For the next 30 days, I will be going homeless. And my goal for the 30 days is to come up with $30,000 in profit, starting from nothing. The reason I'm doing this is to show how easy it is to create wealth. The main reason I want to start this series is to show people that you can start with absolutely nothing and create a business that pays you every single day for the rest of your life. I want to create startup culture for kids, you know, wondering whether they want to go to school or not. I want to give people an opportunity to make a bunch of money on their own. Well, I just feel like people don't know that you can actually make $30,000 in 30 days from nothing. The, like making money is just super easy and you just have to have the right information. And I was super lucky when I was 18, I was given all this information and I kind of have an opportunity now to give some of that info back and teach people in the same way that I was taught. First, I'm gonna be starting off downtown San Diego. Um, nothing in my pocket except for my phone. Uh, my first course of action, I think, will be to convince a couple separate store owners to let me use some supplies to start a home service business. Um, in exchange that I'll, you know, hopefully come back with the money I made and pay them back. Um, make enough money to get a hotel and sleep and, and hire people so that we can scale this as quickly and uh, as efficiently as we can. I would like to be hiring someone to offload the work within the first three days of my challenge. Since I'm going to be doing some sort of home service, um, it's just not going to be worth my time to be doing all the servicing myself. If we really want to make $30,000 profit this month, we're going to need to hire some people. For the next month, I'm going to be knocking on doors and trying to acquire customers. Cold knocking. Bootstrapping just it. bootstrapping it, yeah. Just knocking, knocking on doors. It's the best way to generate business. I'm a direct marketer. I'm not a door to door salesman. I just do direct marketing. Yeah. Here's my card. Yeah. Like first episode is just going up. Because worst like comes to worst. Yourself. Worst comes to worst, we can uh, buy an extra tank and brush off Kijiji or Craigslist, and I can actually sell like 2,500 a day. If we really need to like get our shit together, we can get too clean. Um, now it's really important that we set goals for the next 30 days, because if we want to hit that crazy big goal of $30,000 profit, we're going to need to always know where we're at and know where we, where we need to be at all times. Now for week one, I only have three goals. Number one, I want to make $6,000 profit. Number two, it's going to be super expensive for me staying in these hotels every single night. What I'd like to do is make enough money to have a down payment on my old apartment. Number two, I want to make enough money to have a down payment on my old apartment. Those crusty sheets and those continental breakfasts at the motels, they get old quick. And number three, arguably the most important, we need to hire and train at least one really good employee that is number one, good with dealing with customers, and number two, doing stuff quickly so we can move on and maximize volume and get the day done. Yes, he must be good looking, he must. Now the reason why these three are so important, number one, the 6K, this money is gonna allow me access to better and higher end commercial grade equipment. Therefore, I can do more jobs quicker and for higher pricing. The apartment, me moving into an apartment and getting out of those cheap motels is going to improve my quality of life 10X. The mental stress of me staying in those disgusting motels, it's not worth it. And number three, if we want to do $30,000 in personal services in a single month, we're going to need extra hands to get that work done for us. Now, having that 6K and getting better equipment is going to make week two, week three, and week four 50% faster. Me having my own apartment is going to put me in a better mood. I'm going to wake up in my own bed and I'm going to be more inclined to get on the doors earlier and have better energy. And lastly, a worker. Now, if you're starting a home services business, these are the backbone of your company. Without these guys, your volume goes way down. You're not making nearly as much money. YouTube uploads will be going up Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. And TikTok uploads will be daily. The first upload will be posted on Wednesday, January 12th. My name is Josh Lester, and I'm excited for you guys to follow my journey.